Most of us know Malta as the George Cross Island that broke the Axis back, but to the Navy it's got other claims to fame. Although more than 2,000 sea miles from England, it's a place which has close links with home, and many of those links are to be found in the fine handwork of Maltese lace. A cunning hand and unlimited patience go to the making of genuine Maltese lace. In it, much of the history of the island can be traced. Its technique is closely related to the bobbin lace of medieval Genoa and Saxony, and there's little doubt that many of its secrets were brought to the island by the Crusaders. To the yeoman of signals from HMS Chieftain, it's just one more trip ashore. As a bunting tosser, he doesn't pretend to be an expert on lace, but he knows that apart from its beauty, each square yard takes a whole month for a woman to make. And that's a standard which tells quite a lot to a matelot. He'll buy all right, even if he doesn't know it's good, the missus does. Soon he'll have to come back for more. <laughs> 